Hi everybody, welcome back to Swarm. My name is Mikey Dubs and we are playing Seraphine the Magic Caster for actually the first time. What is my passive? Seraphine has a 33% chance to multicast a projectile. Oh, that's cool. It's fun. There we go, there's my 33. I get to multicast, it's sick. My E, my E ability. Seraphine grants a 400 shield and move speed to herself and allies around her for, for five seconds. That's pretty nice. R, the perfect no. I've seen this one before. I know I, I know what this R does, kind of. It's a giant circle nuke. Seraphine sings the perfect note, halting all enemies in their tracks and protecting allies with invulnerability for three seconds. At its crescendo, a ring of force is let loose. Hold on, give me a second. I, I'll, I'll learn about the crescendo here in, in a second. I need to play a little bit more efficiently. Give me that XP. Thank you. I really think these slicers make sense for this character. Okay, I need to know what it does at its crescendo. At its crescendo, a ring of force is let loose, dealing 130 damage and pushing all enemies back that it collides with. Okay, sick. Very nice. It's okay, we, we can make projectile spam work. We can make all kinds of things work. I I'm a big train guy. I need projectile count to make sound wave level up. I need health regen to make cyclonic slicers level up. You know, it's like health regen. It's a really good stat to get early on, in my opinion. So I put it on my shield right now. Is it? What else does it give me? A shield and move speed. I see. Okay. Destroy that and we get a power up, whatever this does. Just a vacuum. I see. Mm, do a damage crit chance or armor here. These, these slicers cannot crit. They cannot crit. The sound waves can. Let's go a little bit crazy. Let's go damage. Okay. So a little bit crazy. He's like, wow, like man makes the least crazy decision in the history of gaming. True. What's your point? I would like to get projectile spam going. That's that's what I'm most certainly interested in. How about a little bit of shield action for you? Oh, you meet quest to spawn. I'll make my way over there. As soon as I pick up all this XP and don't, don't die. Certainly. I need the XP, everybody. Do I take move speed or crit chance? I think it's this is an easy move speed angle. So right now we've got health regen, damage, and move speed. I'm all about... The static shiv, I am. Yeah, let's, take, let's get our, our third weapon locked in here. Put on our shield, collect this XP. We gotta get down to the Yumi quest. Turn on auto aim for a bit. We got bosses that are spawning, and we got quests that need to be completed. Yumi, what you got for me? Push the ball to make it grow. Got it. Easy money. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, do I want to gain ultimate haste, heavy hitter, or pick up radius, or, or the vacuum? I'm, I'm that dude. I'm about to use my ultimate. Oh, yes. Let's get some trains going. I'm that dude. Let me let me use my ultimate. Because I just got the haste for, for it. Huge, huge. Doesn't kill the boss or off rip, but that's fine. So we took damage, so we can actually get a fully leveled up train. If we want it. But next, I do want projectiles, though. Excuse me. <clears throat> Pardon me. I'm a big, I'm a big level up train guy. I'm going to swap to manual aim so I can take down this boss at a little bit faster right here. Good train hit. Excellent train just kiting out. Come on, we're, we're almost there. I need my Cyclonic Slicers. So use my ultimate on cooldown, obviously. We could lock in our final weapon here. Or we could get the projectile count that we oh so desperately desire. There we go. Very nice. The ultimate haste on, is going to go crazy the whole game, I think. Plus, if we can get projectile account, we can get our main attacks going a crazy mode. 
We do have what it takes to make Blade Rank pop off, and I think we lock it in for our final. When Blade Rank stand, let's go. Get two Blade Rags going on. Oh, you want to lock me in? Guess what happens when you lock me in? I lock you in, homie. Target the wall. Please, give me, tell me I, I got the damage. I have to do a lap real quick. Don't mind me. I just got to do a quick lap. I'll be back. Don't worry. Hey, right back. Here we go. The wall didn't break. The wall still holds strong. I got to do another lap real quick. Don't mind me. No, I'll, I'll be back. Okay, here we go. Who, which one of you is it? Is it you? Are you low? Yes, okay. The wall. Wait, you can just wait out the, the wall? Yeah, that's some new tech. Let's roll. Get in there, train. It really is just my ultimate that's going to be doing most of this damage. How about some more trains? I'm down. I'm down to just have my train do everything. More damage, please. Thank you. More train, please. No. We go, Slicers. We haven't gotten an upgrade choice for Soundwave so far this game. So we haven't really gotten what it takes so far. I think Static Sword is just a really awesome one to take. I don't have... I don't have uh, the health. Max health, though. I can't evolve it. That's okay. Right, let's get a little bit more involved here and press R. And let's go damage. The more damage I can get in these trains, the better. More damage. Let's go. I feel like I'm already kind of survivable. What I just need is more damage. Alright. Let's see. What do we get? Boom. Does it, does it pull in enemies to it and blow them up? Oh my gosh. Level 4 train? No, it just pulls in all the, all the, all the drops. Which is, which is fine on its own. Six, 16 seconds into my ultimate ability. That's fine. All right, we run up here. We're, we, it, I mean, it is juke season. That's what I've been trying to tell you for like years now. Drop my alt. I can finally upgrade sound wave. Let's do it. So now I can get a lot more area of effect damage with my sound wave. How about some sound wave upgrades? I mean, damage is fine too. Don't mind. Don't want to damage at all. You've got movement speed, projectile count, damage, and health regen. I mean, you can't ask for much better than that. Sound wave level three. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. When we rotate to the outside, to the inside, to the outside, to the inside. Can we push straight through? We do take some damage, but the train cleans up. Yeah, I'm gonna press E. I do want to get to some of those power ups. To some of those experience points, I mean. Ooh, there's a, there's a guard back there. We gotta get to that card. Why don't we just go like this? Wipe the whole map. Blade rank level 2. Okay. We go for the XP first. Soundway level 4. Close to its evolve now. Soundwave and train. Give me this, those two, and I'm happy. Oh, taking some damage now. Taking some damage now. How about a little bit of a runaway tech here? Put up shield tech. A little bit of lag spike. This is on the PBE server, so sometimes you gotta give it just a second. Hopefully it doesn't end my run. Ooh. We're fine. We're fine just for a second here. Let's just go ahead and proc my shield. Get to the seal buff. Thank you. Thank you. I have my R in two. Have my R in one. Have my R. Pop it. We want to get to that Yumi zone over there. Press my shield. It gets hit up pretty good, but we're actually going to pop this this shield. It's usually lose it at this point for this bad boy. For this big heal. Okay. Oh, they want to lock me in. They want to lock me in. I can't be locked in. That's the crazy thing about me. Definitely basically killed myself by just brute forcing through that shield zone. Destroy the vases. Got it. Got another shield. That's what I'm talking about. I need to. I need to find some vases. Here we go. 
I have my ult now. Let's use it here. Okay. And I got the bosses that I needed. Gain health whenever you gain gold. That's pretty nice. Um. Yeah, let's do that. Let's gain health whenever I gain gold. That's a nice for like a, a pickup item build. Good job, train. Okay, we're actually doing pretty nice here. We need one more, one more upgrade on Soundwave, two more on train to get to the evolve states. We have a Kogma to fight here, but I got 18 seconds of my ult. Don't walk into it. There we go. Got my shield. Nine seconds of my ult. All right, level f level five train. It is almost there. It's doing big deeps. One more and we take it there. Ooh, Juke City. And then you pop my ultimate between them. Juke, Juke. We weren't expecting it to kill these lads, but we were expecting to get them close to dead. And then that's just where we are at. The, yes, the evolved form of the train. The FC Limited Express. It's beautiful. Plant Nagami, yes! The Anima Echo evolves. Seraphine sends out a wave of sound. Damaging and slowing enemies hit. Amazing. Alright, so now my, my passive strikes and my trains pop off. How can they stop us? It's the it's the root toot build. It's the hoot toot build. I need to get this XP though. It's pretty far out there. There's no, they have no options. They have no options. All right, let's roll. Uh, projectile count, I think, might be in the cards here, actually. Let's get our projectile count up. That way we can send out more of my waves. That pink goes out and the blue comes in. Pretty cool, huh? Look at that. Pretty awesome. I'm looking for enemies, honestly. Anywhere I can go. The more projectiles I can get of this, the better. Rek'Sai's gonna spawn. I'm not gonna have any XP, lads. Let's... let's. Oh, here we go. How much damage is that gonna do to this lad? Oh, oh, man. That's a lot of HP. Catch the jumper. Catch the jumper. Get the train on it. Get the train on it. There we go. There we go. A, a level 5 damage boost. Let's go. You don't mind that at all. Grab my shield. Let's see. Static. Go, let's go extra projectiles. Extra projectiles. Yes. More. More orbs of Seraphine. Let's go. The mage class. But some of the challenges to unlock the the the, the f further up characters are ridiculous. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a grind to get there. But I'm excited. This game is just too much fun, honestly. Oh, we pop an ultimate. Center stage. What's it called? The perfect note. Yeah. So this is surround sound. Everybody gets shielded up. She's a really great support class. Very nice. Yeah. Run him over. No survivors. Alright. Surround sound. I got no reason to heal up. I got just to kill as many enemies as possible. That's that's the name of the game right now. Okay, double bosses. Let's go. Projectile count. We'll go level 4 on that. We'll level 4 on that. I have my ult. Let's pop it. Boom. That damage is ridiculous. Movement speed. Okay. Yes. At this point, everything that we get, we like. Even the health regen. Even the health regen. Don't have my ultimate for this guy, but this, the waves of uh, amazing damage clear out everything. I even have the slicers to push back enemies that get close. It's just nice. I have blood ring. So let's just get you. I have your evolve uh, requ required passives trait. So 
Baby, we you're next. Let's go. Is this max projectiles? No, I need one more projectile. Then we got max. All right, Blood Orangi, if you're you're gonna make a push for it, I'm gonna I'm gonna reward you. He's like, I'm gonna be there. I'll show up for you. Let's press my R. Stay on this lad. You can't tell how much HP he has, but he does go down. We do got lots of damage. Oh my gosh, Seraphine is easy mode. I didn't know they made easy mode. Okay. Where's my Yumi quest go? It hasn't spawned yet. I'm already here. I'm, re I'm already ready. The train just runs over everything. Um, The slicers... I can actually evolve you. I'm not sure if we're going to get there or not. Probably not, but miracles can happen. Okay, the Yumi quest. Thank you. What is it? Everyone must reach the destination within the timeline. Okay, let's go. We, we are super speed. Oh, did someone ask for a full wipe? Boom. And we made it. Let's do the pickup radius, I think. We didn't take ability haste, so that the with haste doesn't matter as much. Take the pickup radius. And let's take... Oh, actually, we want projectile count. Yeah, yeah. Alright, movement speed, health regen. Let's take the health regen. Oh, here come the levels, yeah. I think I might have taken the vacuum. Was that what it was? Yeah. Blade of Rang. It's making a push. It's making a push. I should get another level here. Yeah, they're just coming pouring in now. Slicer me. That's it? That's all you got for me? <laughs> just kidding. That was enough. Come on. The game's trying its hardest here. Yeah, so I, I don't pull in uh, items as much, but I do get a vacuum. So we just don't worry about the items. Just keep getting more kills. Let the trains do their thing. And then don't die. As long as I'm smart about my pathing, I should be fine. Step in and out. And then we can press R whenever we want to wipe the board. Hopefully before vacuum. Should be keeping an eye on that though. Okay, here comes the vacuum. Does it go? Does it go off? I want to know exactly when it goes off. Mine goes off at, at 07. Okay, at 07. Slicers can be upgraded. It can be evolved. Let's go. Ooh, only one and a half levels there, though. I need to kill some bigger lads. It the whole the train is ridiculous. Yes, the evolved, the unceasing cyclones, permanently orbiting projectiles, damage and knockback enemies. That is cool stuff. That's very cool stuff. All right, now I got my cyclones. Look at those bad boys spinning. Yum, 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 yum. And I can still do board wipes, and my trains run over everything. Now we're playing swarm. Now we're doing it. Okay, use my shield off cooldown. I have the vacuum, so that'll pick up pick up a lot of things for me. We're trying to get as many enemies on screen as I can. I want the train to run over people. There we go. Rexia spawn. Let's roll. Okay. Let's go to. The static shiv. I wish I could have gotten. I wish I could have gotten maybe another evolve on this blade orang, but that's okay. We find the tunnel. We kill the tunnel. Keep our blade orangs on it the whole time. Turn on our manual cast and look at Rex. I just get absolutely shredded. Let's go. Oh, back it on up. Oh, get out of the circles of death. As long as I don't get stuck into a circle of death, this boss is over. Knocked me up a little bit there. We go back to the uh, back to the scene of the crime over here. 
Look at Rexai. This takes so much damage whenever you destroy a tunnel. Crazy about Seraphine is you have movement speed and big old shields. And I can just press R all the time. Okay, wait for the circles to go away. Don't step into them. Destroy this tunnel with our blade orangs. GG. Yeah, Seraphine feels really, really strong, especially with those with those weapons and everything like that. Anyways, if you liked the video, uh, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.